and fellow awesome, awesome nerds. nerds. I am Baku Kid. And I am Baku Dad. And, and we, we are, are the Baku, Baku Boys. And if this is your first time to the channel, please... Like and subscribe. Also, please be sure to drop us a comment so you can help keep our channel growing as we do try and release weekly Bakugan, Beyblade, and other awesome nerdy content every Wednesday, Wednesday Friday, Friday, and, and Saturday. Saturday. But with that being said, let's go ahead and jump into what we've got in store for you guys for this video. So, today is... Friday, Friday, February 25th, yes. and for today's video, we are going to be playing Bakugan Melee. The Return of the Tiebreaker. Yes, yes, because last last episode we did, we only played two rounds, and we both won one, and Baku Kid didn't want to go ahead and do the tiebreaker in that video, but that's okay, because we decided we were going to go ahead and do the tiebreaker for this video, and upon doing this one, um, I we actually did a little bit more research on Bakugan melee rules, and we kind of have been playing things a, a, a little bit differently. But we we followed uh, uh, we're following Jet Kuso's rule rulings for Bakugan melee, and my key, and it might be a little bit more interesting because of. <sighs> Critical knockouts and... Critical knockouts. <coughs> and <coughs> different strategies on how to get double scans and knockouts and <coughs> scoring gate cards. But we are not going to waste that much more time. We are going to go straight to the table where we are going to have our tiebreaker round for Bakugan Melee all set up and we will be ready to do this. And Catch you guys in just a moment back at the table. And we will also be doing a bonus. A bonus round. Okay. See you guys back at the table in just a moment. Yeah. Welcome back to the table where we are doing the tiebreaker of Buckagon Melee and seeing who will win. Yes. So, actually before we start, because we normally did it where youngest player went first, and after reviewing the rules, we actually were doing that all wrong. So we are going to <coughs> start by flipping a Baku core. So we will consider that heads and that tails. So Baku kid, call it. Heads. Tails. So I get to go ahead and place first gate card. Okay. Okay, now let's reposition them. Make sure that they're as centered as possible. All right. Now I will start. Okay. Pence tar landed on that one. Ooh! You got the stand with Fenica. Let's go ahead and reposition this real quick. We cannot touch the Bakugan. We can reposition the gate card, but we can't touch the Bakugan. So you can't just go boop. Nope, you cannot touch the Bakugan. Once it's on the gate card, it you you got to keep it there. All right, let's see. Um... Nellius. Can I, can I go like in an angle like this? Mm-hmm. Okay. You can also try and do uh, uh, spin shots too. Oh, I missed with Nellius. Ooh, that would have been good. And if you would have actually knocked Pinsitar off and stood on that, that would have been a critical knockout and you would have actually got that gate card for that. Okay. All right, go Nellius. Oh! Oh, it's still touching it. It actually is. It it barely even is. Actually, he is off the gate card. The majority of him is off the gate card. Oh. Like, uh. -uh. It's, well, that's still on the gate card, so do you want to count that? Or do you want to count that most of him is off the gate card? Most like, of him is. Yeah, I was going to say, I would consider this a knockout because 
he's almost completely off the gate card. Even though he's like yeah. hanging on by a thread, he's mostly off the gate card. So that actually counts as a knockout. So Nilius accidentally knocked out Pensatar. Yes, you know. Well, and also he wasn't like touching. Well, well, and also he was his magnet wasn't on. Well, even if the magnet is not touching, as long as the feet are touching, or he's on the gate card mostly, that would actually count. Ooh. <laughs> I literally just, like, tried to knock Amelia's off. So, um. You can go for a Pizzatar again. And try to initiate a battle. Actually, I am going to set... A gate card and oh <laughs> that was that was a fail yeah that was a complete fail um, you didn't get that yeah And it popped right off. Yep, I see that. I need to figure out how to get my flick shots better. Mm -hmm. What I was trying to do is I was trying to do a power shot and knock Nilius. Nope. Nope. Did not work. Did not open on the gate card. Okay. Um, no, I will wait. Oh, there we go. I shoved Nellius for the double stand. And that actually worked with Pinsitar. So I get that. You almost knocked out Fennica. His magnet is still on the gar cards. Her. her magnet's still on the cards, so that counts. But you almost, if you would have knocked her off, that would have been that would have been a knockout. But what if I did it and I stuck on? If you would have did it and they both would have stuck on? If you would have knocked out Fennica and Dragonoid would have stood, that wouldn't have counted as a double knock or a critical knockout. That would have oh. just been you just knocking out your own. Okay. Now, if you do that on an opponent, that's different. Yeah. Okay. You know what? Yeah. Yes! This is my gate card. No, that is actually my gate card from the beginning. Because right. that is your gate card. I know that one. Oh. So you've got 800 B power, and then I have 700. But it is my gate card, so gate card open. Just in case if I have to use. And yeah, I knew it. So zero for Chaos and plus 300 for Ventus. So that puts me at 1,000 B power, and you are at a. You are still at eight. What are you gonna do? I know if I use these, then you will use them. Mm-hmm. Don't know. I want this gate card? You want the gate card? Yeah, I want it. Well, I want that gate card, too. I want! This is the tiebreaker. I want to win. This is, a, this is actually a good tiebreaker right now. If you throw all three of your Baku cores, I'm going to do the same. Mm -hmm. But that means you won't be able to use them for the rest of the match. I will let you win. You'll let me take it? 
Okay. Roll back up your Fennica. Yeah. I claim my second gate card. I forgot to check what, which one this one You is. can actually check what it is. I'll let you do that real quick. Okay. Let's try and line these up. Ooh, okay. Hmm. I'm going to use piece of tar. Am I going to use Pinsitar? Possibly. <laughs> Ooh, wow. Well, that worked. That actually does work. He he jumped on this. He, he activated on that one, but went to that one. I tried. You were trying for, you were trying for the critical knockout. I was trying to knock them off. It didn't work. Oh, well, but you're in bold now. Mm-hmm. That was that was a good try though. Still do it. Hmm. You're gonna win anyway. But remember, we're doing a bonus round. Let's try Nilius. Nope. I see what you're trying to do. Well, I'm trying to see if I can get the double stand on it. Nope. So close. Pinsitar doesn't want to move. Ah! But I want him to. Dragonoid, come on, please help me. You know what? Let's try and get the double stand on this card then. Nellius got it. Ooh. My foot is touching it. Your though. foot is touching it. But most of him is off. So how do you want to count that? Mm. Like he's almost all the way off. But his foot is touching. Can we count this one? We'll actually count that one because his feet are touching. Yeah. But guess whose gate card that is? It is yours. How much? I have 600. You, so have, you 600. have 600. I have 600. Do I have? Six? Yeah, you, ha you have. You do. Oh, yep. Yeah, they are both at 600. Okay. So, Dragonoid's feet were touching. We will count that. <sighs> Gate card open. They are both darkest. So it is a tie. Uh. <gasps> mm. How? Uh. <laughs> you, if you, if we throw all of our Baku cores, it's still going to be a tie. So we can both retract our Bakugan for it being a complete tie. <laughs> it was a complete tie. It was a complete tie, but that means that gate card is open. So there's your Bakugan back, and there's my Bakugan back. I would not I would not waste cores on that if it's going to be a tie like that. <laughs> it's a tie. Okay. That was actually a, that was actually a good, good way to pull a stalemate. And then that means that I had to pull back my Pinsitar. Oh gosh! You actually did a you you did a pretty good strategy with that. But I can still get the double stand. No, no, <laughs> Mist with sectinoid. I wonder how much. Depot. You need to be from further away. That's way too close to the gate card. Flip these nuggies. 
I already saw how much B power Nilius has. I touched. I mean, no, that does count. That yeah. does count. So that's a double stand. Yes. Okay, well, I, I, I wanted you to get a battle, so then I would win with um, Fennica. Well, you got the double stand with that, with Dragonoid and Fennica. Yes, I did. So that was good. Yes. All right, so, let's see. Sectinoid, don't fail me. Sectinoid, fail him. Ah, that's a fail. You mind me going from here? Here. Let me move those. Because you need to do it from like almost to the edge if you're going to do it from that spot. Okay. I got the double stand. Which means... You won. I have won this round, and that wins me the tiebreaker, but we are doing a bonus round, and you moved the table. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's okay. I didn't mean to. Okay, now, you get to get different Bakugan for the bonus round. We're going to grab different Bakugan? Yes. All right, how long is that going to take us to get different Bakugan? Uh, if we don't want, if we don't want to change our Bakugan, then, um, we can keep ours. And like... Well, how long are you going to take to switch your Bakugan? I'm just switching one. Oh, you're going to switch one? Yeah. I'm just getting another Fennica. Or someone else, maybe... I wonder how much beware the, the... You mean Cubbo? Not beware? Um, Demor, maybe. Demork Ultra? Then I have to swap out one of my cores for an Ultra. If you want to, you can! Oh, you're going to use my Demork Ultra. Yes! And say, and I'm getting rid of this one. I am getting the Mork. The Mork is so cool. How do I close the Mork? So, so the bonus round is only for like changing, and then everything else is just normal. Let's actually do this one then. I don't like this one, but I will use him. Oh, Claptor. Nope. Oh, wait, what? Mantanoid. Mantanoid? Mm-hmm. I thought you used Clop. I thought you were going to use Claptor. Okay. So, everything else is just normal. Mm-hmm. The only thing with the bonus round is just that you get to switch one of your Bakugan. Mm-hmm. Ah. You're using two Ultras and a True Metal. I'm using two Ultras and a Core. Well, you're using a Core and two Ultras. I'm using a Core and two Ultras. Okay, so for bonus round, we still have to flip to see who goes first. Yes. Okay, so you get to call it. Um, Tails. Heads.
Okay. start mantanoid strong oh there we go but that's going to make it harder for me to try and get a double stand on that let me readjust these real quick you need to be to the edge that's too close this is my gay card oh okay that works and that does count he has 300 300 to 800 you want to see what happens when I activate it? I mean, if you want to activate it, you can. You're already beating me. I shall activate it so you'll see what would happen. Yeah. Minus 200 for both of us, but that means you still beat me. Yeah, because you have, cause you would have 100. Mm-hmm. I win. That was actually a good start. Yes. Here we go. Did me good. Okay. Mansonoid is rolled back up. place okay and now let's actually go with Pinsitar oh he's on it yeah he is the darkest first darkest darkest first darkest Oh, you got on that one. All right. Now it's my turn. Well, I accidentally knocked out Pinsitar. Yeah, you did. And I moved the table by accident. Nope. Okay. Can I get the double stand? Nope. nope. More to the edge. Like it? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry to keep on moving the table. I got the double stand. I definitely wasn't trying to eat Penica. I definitely wasn't trying to eat Penica. You were not trying to eat Penica. Not trying to eat Penica. I forgot, Darkest Mansonoid does not have the best B-Power stats. Yeah, he already has like 300. And he's so hard to roll back up. You know what? Because if I can knock Demork out off that gate card with a with a jump from Pinsitar, I could actually get the critical knockout. Yeah.
Oh, stand on that card though. I'll take it. That was weird. <laughs> um, I definitely don't get a retry though. I missed. <coughs> you knocked me out, but you did not get the uh you did not get to stand on the gate card. Yes. So that does count as a knockout. Yeah. But not a critical knockout. Not a critical knockout. Trying this strategy again. You're on it. I landed on the gate card. If I remember, this one's yours? Yes. Okay. Um, Pixar, Pixar card has 600, and the Mark has 700. Um, gate card open. Yep, this is actually mine. You are beating me still by 100. And even if we throw both of all, all of our cores at it, you will still beat me by 100. So yeah. you get to take that gate card. Yes. Thank you. You need one more gate card and I need two. Yeah. I guess the mark is actually really good for me. I tried to get the knockout with Pinstar, but that did not work as well as I wanted it to. Yes. You planned to get the knockout on me, but it shouldn't work. Let's actually move your one gate cards to over here. <coughs> Mark. How are you feeling, me, buddy? a mess. Um, nope. Mantanoid knockout. He knocked himself out. Mm -hmm, he did. Ooh, you got the stand with more culture though. Yes. And I think that is what your gate card right there. Yes. I had no idea what I was playing, but I was trying to do something. All right, Mantanoid, you biscuit eater. <gasps> oh, gosh, that was hilarious, Dad. Dad, that's hilarious. I am not going to try for that. There we go. Got the stand on that. Now let's actually reposition these real quick. You know what I'm going to do, right? Since you, since you got Nilius on there. <laughs> um. 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 I'm more on this one. Kind of. Kind of. Uh. That's almost a knockout in between them. Um, could this maybe, uh, I don't know how to let this one count. Yes. It's really hard to determine because it's like, he's almost off of this card and he's almost off of this card. He's kind of like right in the middle. <laughs> um, we're going to let you retract that one. Unfortunately. Unfortunately. <laughs> I was just trying to, like, not cure mm. nearly it's Well. Well, that works. I got the double stand on that one. Holy moly kakadookie. 
Okay. This is my gate card. It is your gate card. So if you... And I'm not going to use Mantanoid or Pensatar. Let's go ahead and reposition this real quick. Okay, roll up my Bakugan. Okay. Demork Ultra has 700. Nellius has 700. Nellius is the only thing I can use against Demork. Demork at this point. Yeah. Even that's even though that's your gate card. Yeah. Nope, that was a miss. You still have the opportunity to get the double stand for the win. We are both at two gate cards apiece, which is actually cool. Nope. You oh! got the double stand, which gives you the final gate card. Oh. And if and if you got on that, and that's Let's what it, see. that's what it, that's what would have been. It would have been a tiebreaker again because Darkest gets plus one hundred and Ventus gets plus one hundred. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been insane, and then we would have had a we would have had to retract both of our Bakugan, leave the gate card there, and then try again. But you won that one completely. That was awesome. Yeah. And that is actually going to wrap it up for this fun-filled Bakugan melee match. Oh, and that also was I, that was actually really good. Oh, and also now and also now there's another type. Tie. <laughs> because that whenever you um get a bonus round, you also get a point. <laughs> so now we will have to get another tiebreaker. <laughs> okay, we'll do another tiebreaker on the next Friday. We'll do another Bakugan melee. Yeah. Okay. But that is going to wrap it up for this video. We hope you guys did enjoy it. Go ahead and drop us a comment letting us know what you thought of this matchup and what you thought of some of these newer Bakugan and gate cards that we have utilized. Um, but until next video, we are the Baku Boy signing out. I am Baku Kid. And I am Baku Dad. And always remember to stay nerdy and awesome, let it rip, and Bakugan... I blocked you! <laughs> I blocked you! <laughs>